Okay, Darren, I gotta confess, last weekend I was over at your place and after you went to bed, um, I was kind of bored, decided to play around with the security auditing tool um, Auditor. I've heard a lot of good stuff about it. It's actually really cool. I prefer it to Wapix now because the new Wapix is wax based on Slackware and I gotta be honest, like, I'm a diehard, uh, you know, Nopix fan when Dude, it comes to live Nopix. It's awesome. So, um, I did boot it up and uh, played around with it for a little bit and one of the things I wanted to talk about was the Metasploit um, framework. Okay. Yeah, I've heard yeah. about that. It's it's actually pretty creepy. It's creepy how easy it is to use. Um, the first place I heard about it was uh, Iron Geek's website. It's got some really cool security video tutorials and stuff like that. And check it out. Really cool. Uh, anyhow, the Metasploit uh, framework, I keep fumbling over that, uh, basically what it does is it sucks down um, exploits and it gives you like a list of exploits that you can, you can perform with the payload. Yeah. Um, and you just basically like point and click. Uh, it's got a web interface, so it makes it like ridiculously script kitty to use. <laughs> like it's really bad. Really? So I did notice that one of your machines uh, is not patched to yes. Service okay, Pack no, no, 2. No, no. There's a good reason okay. for that. Okay, listen. <laughs> um, when Windows XP Service Pack 2 came out, it's just complete bastardization of Wait, TCP IP. Have you guys patched up? Are you guys patched? I'm sure they're patched. I mean, like, I'm patched. Because uh, I always patch. I mean, yeah. Well, no. Listen, I patch all my machines. I'm a system administrator. I keep everything up to date. But this one machine, I used to see the, the show, right. you know, the torrents. And to get the best speeds on this torrents, you got to be using Service Pack One because right. Service Pack Two just kind of messes no, no, it up. No, no, I, I know I, there's I know. an update. I Actually, but the funny thing is, there's whatever. some really bad security exploits for Service Pack One. Um, as a matter of fact. Uh, what first did you of do? all, uh, well, I, I want to explain a little bit about the framework first. It's actually got a lot of exploits that you can do. Like, for example, ones that target IIS. Um, I think it's uh, SharePoint if you're running front page extensions. Right. Even like Oracle 9 and Microsoft uh, SQL Server. Really? Some hardcore stuff. And like, even I think Apple's Samba Server as well. It's, it's pretty, pretty cool. wild. But one of the exploits is Microsoft Windows XP for Service Pack 1. Right. And um, so you. You uh, can pull up the web uh, interface and select, you know, I think it was the RPC yeah, yeah, 139. MS Blaster. Yep. Yeah, Same so one. You, yep, exactly. So you were able to shut down my machine remotely? Uh, no, 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 no. Actually, it kind of like takes the same attack mm -hmm. and then you can choose which payload you want. Oh, it's okay. actually a, a like, what pretty kind of large selection of payloads. Like, okay, for example, uh, I selected the exploit. The next page was you select a payload. It's got ones like, believe it or not, like you can execute a command. Really? Um, yes, on the machine. Okay. Also, like get a um, command prompt. Whoa. Yes, it's That's dude, hardcore. It's really scary. Okay. And you can also like this is the this is the really funny one. Okay. Um, so don't get mad, but you can also bind the VNC show. Okay. You so, what? No, uh, no, no, yes, no, hold on. No, no. You got serious. on I'm my desktop? desktop? No, I didn't get on it. I mean, it's like point and click. I mean, well, I can't take credit for this. I mean, I'm just like. Well, I don't think anybody can call themselves a hacker from using. <laughs> No, 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 no. This is so, so bad. Like, it's so it's like, easy it's, to use. So, so it's more script kitty than can enable? It's much more. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's so bad. I can't believe so. you got on my desktop, no, 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 dude. But, oh, dude, your desktop is hot, by the way. Hey, like, you know, I can't take credit seriously. for that. That was Tom B. Tom B. in the forums. He like, posted <laughs> right. his awesome I did see website that. I did with some great desktop really cool wallpapers. Desktop. Check it out. Um, but getting back on subject, um, yeah, it's so easy to use. It's ridiculous. So. It's most of the exploits on there are like out, a little bit outdated. So if you keep all your systems patched, it's your not databases like patched, display updates or anything. I, so. Actually, it's funny that you mentioned that because there is like an update script on there, oh, you and uh, I haven't played around with it. But I think you can actually sync it up with like um, Security Focus, Exploit Tree, and Packet wow. Storm, and just like you can go out and search and find an exploit if you don't have one mm -hmm. for a particular system you're targeting. It's pretty nasty. That's like, awesome. And the, I mean, like it was designed had a great application it makes security yeah, so it makes auditing really easy a lot of right? sense for auditors but at the but same time it's got a bad negative kiddies. side effect you know so yeah. um, I mean you know the good outweighs the bad I think in this case totally but I mean nobody's going to call themselves a hacker no no, no nobody calls themselves a hacker using this shit but uh, it's it's pretty deadly it's, it's pretty it's pretty crazy what you can do with such a limited knowledge of like security and, and exploits so okay what's so, the what's the moral of the story here the moral of the story is uh, just don't use Windows. Just kidding. Uh, uh, just okay, keep, so no, if you're gonna use Windows, if you have to use Windows, I definitely patch it up. I mean, it's like one of those how things. How many times that, like, have we said that? It's one of those things. Like if you, ha if if your boss is like, I don't feel like updating, be like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, we'll, you're we'll Check it now. You know, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what do you think about it now? Two so, clicks. You know. Yeah. So it's it's Target, pretty cool. It's, it's a lot of fun to play around with, but just don't use it in the wrong ways. Of course you know? not. Of course, we would not promote that. But. Oh. Sounds like a really nifty tool. It is cool. And uh, <laughs> thanks for owning my box. I'm gonna go update now. I suggest that everybody else the same. Yep. Uh, for any of the stuff that he's talked about here, uh, check the show notes. Show, show. Hack5.org.
Woohoo!